Hey guys, Ash here from C4E Tech and currently official Cyanogen Mod 12.1 Nightlies are available for the Galaxy Note uh, 4. So it's available for two variants of the Galaxy Note 4, the uh, SMN910G that you see here and the SMN910F. So if you have either of these variants in this video, I'm going to show you how to flash Cyanogen Mod onto your phone. So guys, the prerequisite here is that you need to be rooted and have a custom recovery like TWRP installed. If you haven't done that already, I have a video tutorial on how to get that done. I'll leave a link to that vid uh, video in the description down below. I'll also have a card that pops up just about now. So uh, the next thing is that you need to back up all your apps and data because in order to flash the uh, Cyanogen Mod 12.1, we will have to do a full factory wipe. So assuming that you've done both, let's proceed. So the first thing you do is head on over to the download section in the description. Link one is what's gonna get you Cyanogen mod. Go ahead, download the relevant file and transfer it to your internal SD. Link two would take you to this page. Over here, download uh, G apps for Android 5.1. You can download any of the G apps packages, just read about it and make sure you download the Google app package that you want. So basically you get just the basic Google server services uh, like what I'm gonna be flashing in this video or you can get the entire Google package inclusive of all Google Apps. So just uh, basically it's, it, it's up to you. Choose what you want, download it, transfer it to your internal SD. So once you've done both, go ahead, turn off your Galaxy Note 4. And once it's off, hold up volume, power and home at the same time. Let it go once you see Note 4 displayed on screen. So this would take you to your custom recovery TWRP here. So the first thing you do is select backup and uh, swipe to backup. So this would backup your uh, firmware in case something goes wrong, you can always come back and restore it. So I've already backed it up, here's my backup. So the next thing you do is go into wipe and swipe to factory reset. So once you've done that, go back, select install, scroll down, select CM 12.1 and swipe to confirm flash. So this would take a few seconds to a minute to complete. Just wait for it to get done. So there you go, it's done. Going back, now select uh, the G apps package. So like I said, I'm using the um, nano variant. That's the small, one of the smallest packages available. You could use the full package as well. Doesn't make a difference. Uh, as far as the procedure goes, it just it's just the Google Apps that are preloaded. If you go with the Nano uh, package, you could download the remaining apps from the Play Store when, uh, as and when you want it. So that's done. Now select Wipe Cache slash Dalvik. Go back, select Reboot System. So now your Galaxy Note 4 will boot into Cyanogen Mod for the first time. And since this is the first boot into this ROM, a fresh ROM, your boot times might be longer than your regular boot time so don't panic if the phone takes about five minutes to boot up that's to be expected it's normal so just wait just wait and i'll be, I'll be back with you guys once my note 4 is booted up so there you go guys we're up so the brightness is going to be all over the place till i run through setup so i'll be back with you guys once i'm done with setup so there you go we're up quickly going into settings just to show you guys about phone, we're currently running Cyanogen Mod 12.1 and that's built on top of Android 5.1 Lollipop. So I guess that's pretty much it guys for this quick little tutorial on how to flash Cyanogen Mod 12.1 onto your Galaxy Note 4. Hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, please do give this video a thumbs up and for more videos like this, do stay subscribed. If you do run into any issues, if you have any queries, I will leave a link to the original thread on XDA developers forums in the description down below. Make sure you check that out or if you still do have any queries, do let me know in the comments below and I'll try to get back to you as and when I can. So I guess that's it. Thanks a lot for watching. Till next time, this is Ash here from C4E Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye bye now.